Dear subscribers, as you know, we shared many information for you, and we are studying very hard to find current news for you. However, I cannot use this channel for future. Please follow our new channel called As Daily News Report and watch our video to support us. Link in description. Also, you can reach the video we shared on Daily News Report by clicking on the top right button. We highly recommend watching, subscribing and sharing. We will continue to share some news on this channel where we take precautions against some situations for future. Thank you for supporting us. I would put out a visual for you so you can get a handle on where we've been and where we are now with regard to this stock market. Again, and I've been covering this for years, we are existing in an economic and financial fantasy land where world central banks have inflated a bubble in debt around the world unlike anything we have ever seen before in the history of the world and here is the proof of that um, right in, in front of you let's look at the last two previous bubbles and how they ended that dot-com bubble if you're as old as I am you you remember that well we're hearing a lot of the same things now that we were back then oh the stock market is going to go higher nothing's going to stop it um, this bull market is just going to continue and continue well <laughs> well there it is look how it ended we heard the same thing in 2008 just like we're hearing now housing is going up markets are going up it's not going to stop Dow 20,000 Dow 50,000 well look how that ended same exact rhetoric now but again this these things never last and every single time you hear one of the pundits on the mainstream financial channels trying to justify where we are now. It's the same story. Oh, this market's different. It's different this time. This is what you hear at the top of every one of these bubbles. But it's never different. It's always the same. Whenever assets become so hyperinflated like they are now, they will correct to fair value. But as you can see from this chart, the bubble that we are in now is twice as big as either of the two previous ones that we've experienced most of us in our own lifetime here so the action in this stock market has been nothing short of historic again we have not had a nine day losing streak in this market in almost 40 years I think the market is trying to tell us something I think the bond market is trying to tell us something I've been covering this at length uh, in my videos lately as a matter of fact you all know this I predicted that this would happen before it did no one else did not one other person I can think about got it as accurately as I did check my channel look at the videos I gave all of you warnings I said red flags were popping up all over the place you can expect something to happen and what just happened has not happened in almost 40 years so I want you to get a visual eyes on a visual on where we are now and where we could possibly go um, and I've been talking about trying to protect your investments right now. Don't let what happened last time um, destroy you financially because I can promise you this bubble is different. It's much larger. The damage is going to be much greater. And the Federal Reserve is powerless. They can't do what they did last time. At the bottom of the 2008 housing bubble, the Federal Reserve started printing cash out of thin air, buying assets across the board, and that inflated again this debt bubble, which has inflated the stock market bubble which we are in now demonstrated in this chart and the ho another housing bubble what's the Fed going to do this time they're gonna print more cash out of thin air continue to buy everything if they do that they destroy the currency they wipe it out we've already lost 90 plus percent of our purchasing power Federal Reserve is admitting that inflation is kicking in if the Federal Reserve decides to print more cash out of thin air or decides to add them to a digital screen you will see the value of your currency evaporate and we will end up in a currency crisis unlike anything we've ever seen before we will end up with a resource problem there will be pandemonium in the streets of every nation on earth and right outside your house if you live here in the United States this bubble is bigger than them all this bubble 
is will be more devastating when it bursts than them all, and it will burst. Now, looking at this chart, keep this in mind. There is no guarantee that this market is going to go down from here. I just want to put a perspective on this for you so you can understand where we are and where we could possibly go in the not so distant future. Um, so if you take anything away from this, it should be it should be simply, are you ready? Are you ready for this?